crock back in the house. Girl, I seen it, honey. I seen it with my own eyes. We just got to pray for him. We got to pray, honey. He didn't get to see that last live. He don't know what's going on, honey. And it's so that he need to help people. And he don't really realize that helping people sometimes means putting yourself in a situation that is just not healthy for you. And I feel like he just keep trying to help people. Hence, I guess they is, you know, possible baby mamas, baby mamas. When you're trying to help people that's, that don't have good intentions for you, if it don't go their way, I just, I don't, I don't know what to say. He didn't get that from me and he didn't get it from his daddy. So I don't, I don't know what to tell y'all. I really don't. All y'all look at, all I can say is, all you could do is pray at this point as a as a fan as a friend as a mother all you could do is pray we all heard her we all heard her voice we all saw the demon at the same time we all saw the demon come out he didn't get to see it but we all saw that hateful evil spirit come out against me and my son at the same time and at this point all you could do is pray for him Whether I have good intentions or bad intentions over nobody. Even if I thought it or felt it, I would never let it roll off my tongue. You can always see a, a demonic spirit because it can't control itself. It's just going to be an outward expression out of their mouth. The tongue, the tongue is like a double-edged sword. So she knew she was about to be evicted. She knew she had all these different things going on and she took that out on me. Cause y'all know I ain't been nothing but nice and respectful to the child since I found out she was with child. Okay, I'm, I couldn't stand her before. I don't even, that ain't even my problem no more. But I tried my best and I see how he fell for it too. Cause I fell for the same thing. Like, oh, you know, she's a mother now. She's with child. She possibly got our child. So I fell for it too for a long time. I fell for it and so he just have to wake up like I did and see it he didn't get to see that devil come out we saw it and if that's what y'all do that's what y'all do just keep that over there I got my holy oil and my <laughs> and, and, and everything I need over here so I mean we ain't lying we heard her we heard that spirit that's not something to lie about I would never lie on somebody like that that scared me. It ain't too much stuff. It scared me for him. It scared me for her. It scared me for the child. Like, I just, I never seen nobody with a kid talk like that. And he keep thinking he got to, like, help save somebody when they ain't got nowhere to go. And that's not your problem. I don't know if she evicted or not. I know I don't go over there. I just know whatever y'all send me with the vacates on the door. I, I'm not over there. I don't know those people. I don't know nothing about that. I just know what y'all send me. I don't personally want no parts of it. That's his life. He got to live it. I don't personally want no parts of it. He is evicted or she ain't evicted. Vacate. Vacate immediately. What that mean? That's what the paper sent y'all sent me. I don't know the difference. They already got married, remember? He got married to her, then he got married to Jaden. He done been married nine times already. What's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Lynn from Kenya, East of Africa. And guys, you're very welcome to my channel. In case this is your first time here, please consider subscribing so that you can always stay updated whenever I post a video. Also, in case you're a returning subscriber, thank you very much for always coming back. I don't take your support for granted. Anyway, straight to today's video. As you can see, guys, Kalisa was just addressing, you know, Chris Shine, you know, uh was just addressing Krishine because you all know that Krishine announced that she moved back to Blueface house you all know that Blueface is in jail and even before uh Blueface went to jail because of probation violation uh Krishine already 
Christian and bro and uh, Blueface, they do not have a good relationship. They are always fighting online, you know, arguing on Insta lives, not wanting to see each other, you know, just dragging each others online through comments, what and all this stuff. But now, guys, uh, the big question is, you know, Mrs. Kalisa was just wondering why Blueface's son just allowed Christian back to his back to his house because you all know about everything that Christian talks about. You all know how uh, Krishine paints blue face badly. You all know how sometimes we feel so bad for Krishine. Sometimes we are so always so, so, so masterful. You know, for Christian, because we feel like blue face is not the right man for him. But guys, look at this, you know. Mrs. Uh, look at this now. Christian, the one who is always crying because of Blueface treating him bad, is the same Christian that say that, you know, she is back to Blueface house. I don't know how that sounds to you, but to me, it sounds a bit ridiculous because I'm starting to wonder, does Krish is Christian always trying to take us for granted? Because why is she always crying, you know? Tears of, you know, tears of crocodile tears let me call them that because you know why would you cry about someone treating you so bad saying that you don't want to see that person then the next minute you're the same 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 person that is saying that is moving in in his house anyway i don't know what y'all think because apparently what on the uh, street is that uh jaden and blueface are no longer together because you all know that jaden is dating her bookie and people felt like Jaden just abandoned Blueface after Blueface went to jail. And also, you know, a lot of people were feeling like Christian is a good one because we have always seen videos of her and Christian Jr. going to visit Blueface in jail. So we can all, you know, uh, we can all agree that, you know, Christian has been quite supportive when it comes to supporting Blueface while he's in jail because there is even a time he went to, uh, for a concert, he had a live performance show and she told everybody you know to shout free blue face because you all know that that slogan has been going around for for a while so that at least blue face so at, at, so that at, at least they can try and see whether the authority will hear their voices while they say free blue face you know Christian has moved into uh, blue face house a lot of people are saying that blue face is just using Christian and simply watch uh, people are saying that blue face is using Christian by telling Christian to move uh, to that house so that you know every bill in that house can be paid so that blue face cannot so that uh, that house cannot be taken away from blue face because you all know that blue face bought Jaden a house even before blue Blueface went to jail and one thing that people are starting to wonder a lot is you know why Jaden has never said anything about you know Blueface being in jail and all that stuff anyway I don't know what you all think because we all know that um Jaded is the fiancé to Blueface. Christian is just a side chick. I guess that is all we know because even Blueface said that uh, that baby that Christian says that is Blueface. Blueface said that that is not his child and he scientifically proved that. Anyway, I don't know what y'all think. Just go in the comment section and tell me what's your view, what's your opinion because Mrs. Kalisa is not happy because she's feeling like his son is getting used by these baby mamas. You know, Mrs. Kalisa is just feeling like uh, Blueface is helping someone who is ungrateful. Anyway, just go ahead in the, in the comment section and tell me. What do you think?